Good day, everyone, and welcome to today's video. The Cavapoo is the subject of today's video. Before we continue, please remember to like and share our video if you find it useful. Please subscribe to receive notifications when we publish new dog-related content. Cavapoo Overview Cavapoos are hybrid, or mixed, dog breed that are the result of combining a poodle and cavalier King Charles Spaniel. Breeders wanted to mix the outgoing and calmer nature of the Cavalier King with the intelligence of a poodle and hence. They crossbred these breeds to get a hybrid Cavapoo. This breed inherits some of the best features from their parent breeds. They are loved by owners across the world, particularly in the UK and Australia for their well-balanced temperament. This breed makes an excellent family pet and its adaptable nature is suitable for a wide range of dog owners. As a crossbreed, they haven't been recognized by any major kennel clubs. You can find independent clubs created by Cavapoo enthusiasts who are working hard to try and establish the breed. As always, the pros are up first. Cavapoos were bred to be hypoallergenic with the non-shedding poodle genes, so most don't shed very much. They are also a good addition to homes with other pets since they don't have a high prey drive like other breeds. This breed is very curious, playful, and friendly. They can make an excellent family dog and do very well with children. Cavapoos are also very intelligent and relatively easy to train. They can make a good pet for individuals who have never owned a dog before. They are ideal pets both for families, single people, younger people, seniors, and also those who live in the city or countryside. Since the Cavapoo is bred to be loyal and show unconditional love to its owner, it only makes sense that the Cavapoo would be eager to please. Their sweet nature, eagerness to please and low shedding coats make them a good dog for those with limited experience. One of the Cavoodle's parent breeds is the Poodle, the second most intelligent dog breed in the world, which explains the Cavapoo's high intelligence. Now it's time for some cons. Cavapoo has the reputation of being difficult to house train or potty train, even though the Cavapoo can learn other tasks fairly quickly. Separation Anxiety Cavalier King Spaniel Poodle mixes love being with their family members, but do not like being left alone. High Activity
range of 30,000 to 1, 000, 000, 000, depending on various factors like gender, age, bloodline etc. Exercise and trainability, cavies need moderate exercise. They need at least one long walk per day to keep them healthy. Most pups would need 30 to 45 minutes of exercise each day. This can be a combination of indoor or backyard play or walks outside. In fact, experts frequently recommend following the rule of thumb of 5 minutes for every month of age, up to 2 times per day. So, 20 minutes of exercise twice a day would suffice for a 4-month-old puppy. It is best to avoid running or jumping exercises when the dog is young. Excessive barking, hyperactivity, or general disobedience can result from failing to exercise them. This breed enjoys digging holes in the ground and running around playfully. Positive reinforcement techniques are required to train this breed in a proper manner. This breed is intelligent and quick to learn. They require repetition and consistency. Daily training sessions should last 10 to 15 minutes and should be done gently. Cavapoos do not tolerate harsh treatment well. Housebreaking may necessitate a little more patience, as they are slower to learn. These dogs can be athletic too, which makes them great when it comes to agility and obedience competitions. Cavapoo dogs pick up on commands fairly quickly. Use the normal voice you use when praising your pet at the exact moment they have perfected your command. Being house training as soon as your Cavapoo puppy enters the door. When housebreaking your pet, ensure they have access to a toilet every 2-3 to three hours and ideally 15 minutes after eating. Potty training can take a little longer for a Cavapoo to get the hang of. As the breed is prone to weight gain, don't offer numerous food rewards. Socialization is highly important for this breed. Harsh techniques will not be listened to. Keep a calm tone and always be consistent with enforcing your rules. Intelligence, an average Cavapoo could be expected to obey commands that they're given the first time they're asked without the need for repetition 70% of the time or better. This breed is comparatively more obedient than other breeds. Swimming, although Cavapoos are excellent swimmers, it is crucial to monitor them to ensure they are not getting tired as toy breeds often tend to use up energy quicker than larger breeds. Therefore, they may only be able to swim in short bursts. Barking, Cavapoos are known for barking a lot. They have a relatively high tendency to bark and this is usually due to stress, loneliness, being uncomfortable in their surroundings, for attention, or to alert their owners. Weather and Climate Cavapoos do not do well in hot summer weather. A healthy grown-up Cavapoo should tolerate temperatures up to 85 degrees Fahrenheit 30 degrees Celsius, for a brief period of time needed for a daily walk. But it is best to keep their physical activity light on such days. Most Cavapoos can tolerate colder temperatures due to their thick layer coats. Although they can withstand winter temperatures, keeping them outside for too long isn't the best idea. Their small size makes them get colder more quickly than larger breeds. Friendliness Gentle and kind to children of all ages, it's no wonder why this breed is recommended as a fantastic family pet. This canine is sociable and gets along well with other dogs. With the right socialization, the Cavapoo will enjoy being around different pooches. They can live with dogs and cats including other small household pets. They are generally polite and friendly with strangers. Of course, this is dependent on socialization. However in general, the breed is not known to be aggressive to strangers. Adaptability Cavapoos are well suited to apartment living. They are not particularly active and do not require a yard. They only require a daily dose of exercise to be fit for apartment living. They are an excellent choice for seniors, retirees, and singles who live in small spaces. Cavapoos are a great choice for first-time dog owners, as they are adaptable and easy to handle. This breed loves human companionship and leaving them alone for a long time can lead to behavioral issues. Cavapoos show different symptoms when suffering from separation anxiety like excessive barking, howling, crying, growling, 
obsessive chewing on things other than food and toys, pacing back and forth, etc. There are various methods for preventing separation anxiety in cavapoos, such as providing them with treats or chew toys to keep their time and mind occupied. Giving them interactive games or puzzles to keep their minds occupied is another option. Guard slash watchdog. Cavapoos are also good watchdogs, making sure their owner is warned of any visitor that is arriving. They are brave, but you can't rely on them much for protection. These good-natured dogs can't be guard dogs because they're friendly nature. Drooling. In addition to shedding less, Cavapoos also take on their poodle parents in that they do not drool much. This lack of drooling helps eliminate the potential for allergens in their saliva. Health Issues Cavapoos are susceptible to the same health issues as poodles and cavalier King Charles Spaniels. Cataracts, epilepsy, progressive retinal atrophy, PRA, and ear problems are among the health issues. Because these dogs' floppy ears are prone to ear infections, they must be cleaned on a regular basis. They might also suffer from skin conditions such as atopy, skeletal problems such as syringomyelia, neurological diseases such as cerebellar abiotrophy, and joint conditions such as medial patellar luxation and hip dysplasia. Have you had any experience with cockapoo? In the comment section below, we'd love to hear your story. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the future video.